Hello coaches. So now you've decided that Pinterest is a good fit for you for social media and expanding your network of friends uh, and helping others get fit. So next we need to set up your account. You can either set it up as a business or individual. I have mine set up as an individual. So what you do, you come over here. I'm going to click on my name. I'm going to check out my profile. And it's just like Facebook. You want it to be about more than just beach body. You don't want to have advertisement looking, commercialized looking photos that are a turn off. You want people to be engaging. So when you come to my page here, you're going to see these different um, folders that I have is what I call them. Uh, boards is what they technically are called, but I call them folders. <laughs> but anyways, so in each board are different things based on the category. So for instance, I have clean eating recipes. So I want the picture to be eye catching. So you can click on this to change that cover, which is real simple. You know, you can just scroll through, but I don't really want to change it. So, but that's about how, that's how you go about changing that cover. So when you scroll down through, you know, you're going to see some things as far as food facts, house ideas, 4th of July. Here's a good instance for Shakeology. I don't have a picture of the bag of Shakeology because that's not really intriguing. I have a picture of Reese cups. That's intriguing. People are going to want to know. What do you mean, you know, Reese Cups and Shakeology? So people are going to click on that. So you can see from my board, I'm about more than just Beachbody. But I have Beachbody in the mix. I have books I read. I like sandals. I have 21 Day Fix stuff. I have, um, I like anything country related. So I'm going to have things about that. So really, when you come to your page and you start to pin things, you want to, you know, make it specific to you. What are you? You know, you're more than just a mom or you're more than just a dad. You're more than just, you know, a full-time employee. What things could you click on all day long that you have interest in? For me, it's scenic pictures. It's uh, house ideas. It's stuff about fitness. Those are the kind of things that I'm drawn to. So that's what I'm going to pin because when people are searching for other pins, they're going to stumble upon me and I want to be engaging. So that's really the basics of setting up your boards. Next, you want to set up a little bit about you. You can see by my profile picture here that I have a before and after. And I have on there, follow me on this journey. I want people to know that, you know, I'm more about than just a quick fix or um, a scheme that gets them to buy something from me. I want them to know that I'm on a mission. I'm on a mission to help other people. I have uh, my link to my blog here for them to contact me there. I have a button here to find me on Facebook. And then also I wrote a short paragraph about myself. It says, I'm a mother of two, a great husband. I have a passion for health, fitness, faith, country living, living life to the fullest without regrets. That really ba basically sums up what I stand for. So with that, I've been able to uh, gain followers. And ultimately, my goal is to drive traffic to my blog. In the third video, I'll talk about how you can link pictures to your blog. But really, this um, video is just based on setting up your Pinterest account and being about more than just Beachbody, but still having Beachbody in there. And next, how I reach out to people using Pinterest is this little button here. I click on it. So you're going to see different pins I have people repinned. So I might, you know, click on this person's name. Oh, and she doesn't have her Facebook linked. I like when they have their Facebook linked in. Let's try to find somebody else. Okay, this person does. Perfect. She has a little girl. I have a little girl. We would have things in common. I just take a quick look down at her stuff here. She seems normal. She has things about health. 
Um, yeah, we might have things in common. So from that, I click on her Facebook. Oh, she has more than one kid, it looks like. So I can tell based on her profile that she's not a beach body coach. So what I would do from that, I would send her a short little message. Hey, I see you re repinned one of my items. I see we have a lot in common and I just want to connect you with you. That's simply all I do to reach out to other people using my Pinterest. So that's really how you get started with using Pinterest and not only having people come to you and follow you, but how you reach out to other people for them to follow you.